Hi guys, this is Skip Flash here, and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 5. In the last part, we were charged with eliminating all the microservers on this computer and the undernet, and apparently there's not one here, like I thought there would be. Huh. How about that? I... Well then, where... Where else could one be then? <laughs> I'm trying to think. Could it be just on the... It couldn't be on the homepage, that'd be silly. Wow, okay, again, as I've stated before, this is where I kind of get lost because I don't know where everything is. And let me just put on a, a sneak run, just in case. Even though that would be a waste of a sneak run just to go around through here. Oh, okay, yeah, so he is pissed off at me. You know what, I'm actually, I, I think I know where it might be, I'll just meet you there. Okay, so it's in the terminal computer. Wow, very hidden. Um, so it's Magnaman, and of course... Oh, okay, yeah, I should actually be reading this or something. Uh, <laughs> He's humiliating us because we used to be enemies, but now we're friends, and something other. Hatred, 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 blah, 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 blah. And let's actually turn on Fast Gauge again. As always, forgot to regular it, but that won't stop me now. I wonder if Magnum Man can actually get stunned. I feel like, you know, electric people might have a resistance to that, if I had to guess. But maybe not. But Fast Gauge, yes, let's do things. Oh, no. <laughs> not at all. So again, use the magnet panels to your advantage, and uh, whenever he does this actually, oh wow, <laughs> whenever he um, uses this giant ball of the electricity, he actually will be standing still for a very very long amount of time, which gives you a good amount of time to just punish like hell. <laughs> See this is how long boss fights should be, that long, if I was doing optimal, that's how things should go. Why was that? That was so easy though, my god. Okay, so destroy the microserver. Who who else is left? All that's left is Medi, I guess, and well, Proto Man, but Proto Man's, Proto Man's doing something else. Uh, but I'm still feeling a bit weird, okay. So, is Magnum Man okay? Yes, what did he do? Never mind, blah blah blah. I wonder if he even has a fight Medi. I mean, we just fought her recently. Are they really gonna make us like refight him like a boss we just fought? No, that's probably all of them. I would say Orin, but come on. Orin Island's deserted, like... <laughs> well, who would bother placing one there? Okay, that was all the servers, awesome. That's good. Uh, the real problem... That's right, Nebula used the servers to transmit a signal that painted, planted evil feelings in people's souls. <laughs> of course it's the goddamn internet. I'll check it out. Um... Oh, wow, okay, we might have to... Uh... Fight and we have to delete him. If I find him, I'm gonna drag him back. Okay. But, you know, COD's cool like that, I guess. Is the prime objective. Okay, got it. So, now we have to go to the internet. And you know what that means. Back, back, backtracking. So I will meet you there. At the very end of the internet, where we did the liberation mission. That's where we have to go, at least. Okay, so here we are at the end of the internet. I did fight Copy Medi. Um, while I was in the neighborhood, but I figured we were fighting so many, like, we were refighting so many navvies that I just actually just skip out on that one and I can just do that some other time. So let's destroy giant ass transmitter and, oh, look at that, our, uh, <laughs> our lemons aren't doing anything. I mean, it's immune to my Mega Buster. H have you tried charging it, maybe? Seems a little rat has wandered in. Oh no, it's the door, it's Dark Proto Man again. He found the server somehow, <laughs> you know, in the one place it possibly could be, but it was a waste of time. Got enough data from the recent experiment. Okay, oh, so it was an experiment. Oh, wow. Okay, so, didn't know that. <laughs> and just to show off how badass and how in control of things we are, he's gonna destroy the thing that we couldn't even scratch, and also just destroy it because, hey, we don't fucking need it anymore, man. Even you want the power, don't you? Well, we have it. We can do it without corrupting ourselves. Cod? Uh, who's Cod? I, all I know is the proper pronunciation of that character. Uh, so, and how are you going to plan on doing that? Uh, well, shit. <laughs> he didn't even do anything. He just showed her a palm at us. What is this? I'm going to end this. Yeah, well, you know, you were kicking our ass in that liberation mission. And healing pulse. Alright, yeah, that's right. We have Medi. And she has, you know, the healing abilities and whatnot to soothe the soul. Gotta love it. 
Oh, and I love this theme too. It's very good. Every Battle Network has like a rendition of the title theme, and that's always awesome. Because she's the one who can free Proto Man. Awesome. Who is that? Her team again? No, it's Colonel. <laughs> oh, that's right. Hot damn. Um, we don't even know who the hell you are because we haven't played Colonel. What is this? I mean, if it was like if we we're playing Colonel and Colonel was evil, then Proto Man would show up, and we know Proto Man. Who? What is this? Oh, his wounds were treated with dark power. Who knew? Uh, Regal's Bane. Oh, maybe he sent the message, actually. That would make sense. Uh, is trying to break the power that's ruling Proto Man. Has no idea. Okay. And we're gonna, we're gonna lay down the plan. Well, who cares? Uh, oh, okay. So we're gonna say the plan? It's anticlimactic, I'll tell you that much. And look at that, there's the dark power. Now kill it. Kill it with our wait, really? <laughs> oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought I I thought Bragaman's job was just to stand there while Colonel and Medi do like badassery, but I guess he had to chop down Protoman or something? That's hilarious. And we got Protoman back. Um Yes we did, awesome. There's the uplifting music. Yay! <laughs> that's a uh, homoerotic, but that's fine. Um, I mean, I can understand between like Lan and Mega Man because you know they share like this huge brotherly bond. But our soul is communicated with Proto Man. Now we have Proto Soul, and I actually like Proto Soul. It's a neat soul. Uh, not as good as Colonel Soul, I'll, I'll, I think. I'll give it that much. But Proto Soul is pretty cool. And we didn't have to do a bullshit dungeon to actually get it, so that was cool. We want the same thing as you guys. <laughs> We're from the alternate version of this game. Alright, so he's just gonna bail. Well, that's fine. So let's... <laughs> Speak of mispronouncing names, whenever I was a kid, I'd always pronounce that colonial. Because I didn't know how, like, you know, words worked. <laughs> but not like I still know how words... Not like I know how words work now, though. But, uh... The Proto Man is back. The whole team is here. All seven members. Good God. Well, we know where it is, right? Right? Oh, no, we go. We have a general fix on their base. <laughs> awesome. How? Because we're cool. Oh yeah, that's right. Because uh, because he was evil once. He's lucid now. Um, okay, <laughs> that's a great way of describing it. Yeah, now we have our leader. Um, you don't have to be if you're scared. Oh, so we're gonna cut the the entire like the actual people are gonna leave their houses or something. That's awesome. So we'll be at the park in front of Higsby's at 10 a.m. tomorrow. That's the, like you know, the best place to have like a secret to start a secret operation, right? <laughs> in front of a goddamn public chip shop. Okay, cool. See, Cod's such a good leader. He knows how to talk and stuff. I won't say a word if you go home. That's all. Meeting's over. Alrighty then. So, we just gonna sleep on the matter, I suppose? Yes, I guess we are. Oh, we have control. Uh, tomorrow's the big day. Alright. Uh, I, again, I don't know how much I cut. I'm not gonna assume it's a lot. But I'll... Oh, wait. First of all, confrontation with mom. Uh, she's probably figured things out, right? I was clearing... Oh. What was that? I'm not sure. You might know. Oh, a data disk. Okay. You're gonna have another vision burst, I am assuming. <laughs> and just like all the vision burst, it's cryptic as fuck. Ah, why? Why, Hikari? But first confrontation with mom, right? You're gonna do... Yeah, we're going off tomorrow morning. Yeah, of course. Your face just gave it away because mom knows all. And she does... Yeah, she knows me. <laughs> it's good to know our mom believes in us. She knows we're up to the task. We've done stuff like this before. Land and hub. You see how that works. Okay, so we have mail, and what mail would that be? Oh, Proto Soul. Yeah, we just got two souls already. Awesome. We'll be using Proto Soul too. Um, and yeah, I guess we're gonna check out that vision. We'll be checking out that vision burst next time on Let's Play Mega Man Battle Number Five. Until then, this has been Skip Flash. Hope you enjoyed watching. Bye.